Justin. Some girls dream about their wedding day. Others, like me, dream about the man that they will marry. I prayed for a man who was smart, caring, determined, thoughtful, funny, respectful, loving, and who will be a true partner to me through all of the ups and downs that life presents. I found all of this in you, and it's an added bonus that you're super good looking. <laughs> Crystal, over the past five years, my love for you has grown exponentially. Your passion for life lights a fire in my heart. Your genuine care for every person that you know is contagious and will bond us together for the rest of our lives. I'm the luckiest man on the planet to have met you, and I can't wait to start this journey with you. Today, as we stand here before our family, friends, and God, I promise to choose you every day. I promise to be faithful to you, to be respectful of you, to trust you, to always try to see your side, and to be a united front with you out in the world. I will appreciate you and promise to not take you and all of the sweet and thoughtful things you do for me for granted. I will believe in you as we continue to explore this life together and I will grow with you. And I even promise to remain a lifelong Vikings fan with you even if they never win a Super Bowl. <laughs> I promise to be honest with you, which means you'll probably be sitting through a long talk about my feelings a time or two. I promise to fight with you about the things that are worth fighting for. And I'll drink coffee every morning so that I don't fight with you about the things that aren't. I promise to laugh at your jokes. Well, at least the good ones. <laughs> and, I, and I promise to inspire you, to honor you, to encourage you, and to devote myself to you. Crystal, you mean the world to me, and I vow to love you for the rest of our lives. Because Justin and Crystal have desired each other in marriage and have witnessed this before God in our gathering, affirming their acceptance of the responsibility of such a union and have pledged their love and faith to each other, sealing their vows in the giving and receiving of rings, I do proclaim that you are husband and wife in the sight of God and man, that all people here and everywhere recognize and respect this holy union, now and forever. You may kiss the bride. You are beautiful, smart, compassionate, and determined. As we grow up together, I, will, I promise to always be there for you through the good times and the bad. But hey, that's why God invented coffee, right? <laughs> I promise to be faithful to you, and I promise to cherish every moment with you and the family that we start. I am so excited for the family and life that we'll build together. When our future golden retriever puppy, Hank, joins our family, I know you will be the best puppy dad ever. And if God blesses us with children, I will undoubtedly be obsessed with them. But I promise to not let that love overshadow our relationship. You are the man that I give my heart and my trust to. Whatever life presents us, I will be yours as you are mine. I love you today, tomorrow, and always. My, my quick story is me and Crystal met at 3M. 
Specifically, we met over email, which for two engineers, that's about as romantic as it gets. <laughs> I mean, her spelling was great. Her grammar was phenomenal. You could say it was love at first reply. We thank everybody for taking time out of your weekend to come celebrate with us because this is probably the best night of my life. I don't know about you, but... <laughs> What a great day. We're so proud of these two kids. Thank you for sharing this day with us. And I cannot wait to see how much happiness and great adventures that they can find together and we love you guys. Cheers. But today, I see the most radiant bride. You are beautiful. You are articulate. You are smart. You're compassionate. You're determined. You're successful and you are a role model and a friend to everyone who meets you. And someday, hopefully, God willing, you will become a mother. I can't wait for that day when you guys begin to grow your family and truly begin to grow your own roots. In the end, uh, I think we love him for all those times that he waited for us to get home before the party. And finally, and most importantly, we love how happy he makes her and we love how happy she makes him. These two are two of my favorite people and I will cheers to that.